forms uh, were collected and aggregated. Um, they are, uh, the aggregates are available as copies uh, here this evening for, uh, uh, for the public. Um, the, uh, the it's a new process, and this is this is a kind of a bit of a learning experience. Um, but uh, I think as a as a member of the evaluation subcommittee. The evaluation process has, uh, has been a success. Uh, the evaluation forms con considered uh, six categories. They were uh, numbered or lettered A through F and ranked in, in which uh, each of the members ranked either uh, exceeds expectation or meets expectation or does not meet expectation. Um, I think it's important to, to realize that, that meets expectation is in this evaluation is, was basically an A performance. Um, and that's, that's based on uh, not only, I think, our intent, but in, in evaluating the comments and the, and the rankings that were provided. The first category we, we looked at was a relationship with the school committee, and that looked at keeping the committee informed, providing uh, adequate meeting materials and background information, answering questions thoroughly, uh, assisting in development and recommendation and administration of policies, uh, contributing to a t climate of teamwork, working with the committee to establish goals and plans for the future maintaining a professional working relationship with the committee and openly accepting committee uh, input and, and response, being responsive to committee decisions. Um, the results of the composite are that uh, uh, all five members of the school committee uh, ranked uh, uh, Mrs. Willis's performance as exceeds expectations. Some of the highlights, highlights of the comments were um, met with each member of the, of the school committee on an individual basis, works effectively with the school, with subcommittees, provides a detailed agenda for school uh, committee meetings, returns telephone calls immediately um, as the, uh, uh, the, the chair of the committee, Mr. Webster, uh, commented that uh, he w worked closely together with him, kept her, uh, her remained informed, and other members in the loop on key issues. Um, and uh, my, my comment in this area was that I fully expected a transition period with some gaps in communication and function during uh, her first year here, and I'm pleased to report that it didn't happen. Um, uh, consummate professional and effective chief executive embodies the team model and works support to support the committee's work, appreciate Ms. Willis's openness to criticism and almost complete lack of bias in presenting material to the committee, meticulous, thoughtful, extremely polished in all the work she's done to ensure the committee succeeds, great communication skills, oral and written, collaborates well with the team, team player, and accepts input. And uh, those are, that's a, a kind of a, a pull out of uh, the key comments that and most of the most of those overlapped with um, uh, within the various committee members. Uh, the second category we looked at was educational leadership, and that uh, involved demonstrates an understanding of Im the importance of a collaborative mission and vision that provides direction for the school district, promotes student learning as the focus of all school programs and activities, demonstrates current <coughs> knowledge of instructional trends to involve staff in curriculum planning and program improvement, uses the results of student assessment to identify strengths and develop improvement objectives, encourages the allocation of financial and human resource to, to incorporate technology into the instructional process. In that way, the, the committee, um, uh, uh, parted uh, a bit. There were two exceeds, two meets, and one does not meet. Um, comments uh, would have rated this as exceeds expectations, except that not you would have been privy to enough information 
to fully evaluate this activity. For those areas I did observe, such as superintendent's entry plan, hiring of administrators, and an MCAS evaluation, I'd rank the superintendent as having exceeded expectations. Uh, Kathleen's entry plan was highly effective. She used it to assess the <coughs> existing strengths of the district, and then implemented changes in the organization to strengthen the system. The achievement of our students is paramount in the efforts of Mrs. Willis's learning is the underpinning of not only the core functions of the district, providing nurturing and healthy environment for learning, et cetera, but how Ms. Willis conducts herself in the wider North Reading community. She's taken a strong approach in addressing deficits in some of our student cohorts through assessment, including MCAS, but also through assessment provided by the administrative team. She assembled a dream team of set of administrators who buy into the same educational philosophy, particularly in a central office team. Mission motivates Mrs. Willis and is evident in the initiatives that she and her team have spurred in technology, et cetera. Uh, public relations, the third category. Uh, works with the school committee, town boards, interest groups, community lia liaisons, and others to establish good rapport and effective communication. Communicates effectively through written and oral presentations to staff, students, parents, and community. Encourages community involvement in schools and interacts with parent and community groups. Establishes open communication with students, staff, and parents provides accurate and relevant information to the news media and is available to discuss educational matters with news media as appropriate, presents a strong positive attitude in building public support for the school system. All five members felt that Mrs. Willis exceeds expectations. Uh, comments, uh, met with every official who could impact schools and education as a part of the entry plan, crafted newsletter, weekly articles in the transcript, met with school advocates, attended numerous school functions and athletic events, served on committees which include officials and members of the public. Th this is a major strength area for Kathy. She's, she has brought a refreshing personality to our district. The school committee formed a communication subcommittee at her recommendation. When we were evaluating candidates for the superintendent position, one of the key attributes was communication with stakeholders, students, parents, officials, and the community at large. From the first day, Kathleen has been everywhere. The first address to teachers in September began the accolades. One memorable comment. In 25 years, this is the best address we've ever had. The district's public relations have never been better, beyond my expectations regularly communicates positive messages about our schools to the community, particularly around our school building project. I've never received a single complaint about Mrs. Willis from any parent or any other member of the community. Her presentations to the committee, especially her entry plan, will be legendary for their polish and specificity. She is very organized, which is critical when working with so many groups. Item D. Personnel, human resources. Fosters good staff morale and loyalty to the district by modeling encouragement, professionalism, ethics, and respect. Develops and implements personal personnel practices consistent with professional principles, district core values, and district needs. Plans for the professional growth of all employees by providing a comprehensive professional development program. <coughs> delegates both responsibility and authority ensures the timely evaluation of personnel, informs and advises the school committee in appropriate matters such as collective bargaining, grievance hearings, and legal issues. And again, the committee split. Uh, two exceeds expectations and three meets expectations. Comments. Not enough observations to give more than a meets expectations has done a good job of jumping right into contract negotiations with numerous collective bargaining groups. Excellent management, expanding of professional development and handling of issues. Mrs. Willis wears the uh, human resources hat because she has to. We have no human resources director in our district. Wearing that hat, she has had to hire almost the, an entirely new administrative team in her first year 
and has made fantastic selections. She's developed and following a very transparent process to make hires. I was impressed that Kathleen hired within the school system for many high level positions. Financial management, that's item E, prepares the annual budget with input from the administrative council in accordance with system wide needs, works with the school committee to identify district funding priorities, works collaboratively collaboratively with the town administrator, town accountant, board of selectmen, and finance committee to plan and strategize budget allocations. Employees sound fiscal management procedures, methods, and techniques to prepare, revise, and monitor the budget, provides regular budget and capital improvement plan updates to the school committee, pursues alternative funding sources to uh, supplement program instruction and personnel efforts. Um, meets expectations was for all five members. So all five members felt that she met expectations. Uh, formulated a fiscal year 12 budget on time at level services. Excellent involvement in development. Ms. Willis effectively worked with our capable business manager to execute the budget process. Excellent working relationship with what I've observed. Being Kathleen's first year on the job, I understand she was unable to focus on find, finding alternatives, resources. And lastly, leadership qualities. Models professional, moral, and ethical standards. Displays openness to new ideas and suggestions. Accepting and benefiting from advice. Pro provides stability and objectivity in crisis situations. Demonstrating the ability to mediate and resolve interpersonal conflicts. Demonstrates the, the initiative and persistence needed to set priorities in order to accomplish goals and objectives. Participate in, in professional development opportunities to enhance the district's learning environment. Participates actively on a variety of professional levels. There were four members that said that she exceeded those ex expectations and one that said she met those expectations. Uh, comments is a member and has attended numerous meetings with various organizations, led negotiations with five collective bargaining units, has worked closely with the police department on safety and security issues, professional at all times. Kathy's leadership qualities in her first year have been outstanding, always calm in a storm. Kathy has de dealt well with difficult issues. Rather than her first year being one of transition for us, she hit the ground running and took the helm of the district in steering us into 20th 21st century education. Thoroughly leads the way by example indeed. The en entire administrative team respects Ms. Willis. It's obvious from my observation of their work as a team. Ms. Willis has performed well in crisis situations. Kathleen takes her job seriously. She is a team player. In the wake of high turnover this year, she has provided stability to the school system. She handles the crisis that come up. up very professionally. She is a very goal oriented and able to complete them. And uh, my final comments, uh, uh, I've, I've four final comments. I've summarized the comments thus far, but for the final comments, I'm, I'm simply going to state my own and, and let the rest of the committee add theirs from their own um, uh, evaluation sheets. Kathleen has done a fantastic job this first year as superintendent of North Reading School. She built an excellent rapport in the community and vastly improved district communications to the public. Kathleen seems to be everywhere. She's involved in and, in and leads by example. It has not been an easy year with many key positions to fill. She's been an important resource in advancing the secondary school building project and we're in, indeed fortunate to have hired her. Thank you, Cliff. Uh, anyone else that wants to comment uh, on the evaluation? I just like to read, process? read my um, final comments, final comments and, then, and then I would like a, just a few quick comments. Um, I could not be happier with